morning, we're just downstairs having a little bit of breakfast. Same as yesterday, Stephen's gone for chocolate pancake, nice. Yeah. Uh, mine's not here yet, I'm just having a fruit salad. I've given up on the guy teaching me some lessons. So, instead, I think what we're gonna do is just go and give it a try, maybe. I think we're just gonna, there's a sign down there, or trying to see this. Watch a couple of videos, this may be the stupidest thing I've ever done in my life. It's probably the best. I'm just gonna go and give it a try, I think. We'll see. Oh, look at that. So nice. Mm -mm. I think we have some success. I've just spoken to the hotel guy about uh, bikes. He's going to give me a little lesson on his bike. We don't need that other guy. So get out on a bike, Stephen. Yay. Excited. Stephen's really looking forward to it. Hopefully, we can yeah. do it. That was fine, it was, well, so like going straight, but like when you bend turning and stuff, it's a bit of a thing. I'll get used to it, I suppose, but I'm going to rent one from this guy. Right, my short lesson is over, we're getting on, yikes. We've made it to Hospital Cave, it was about a 15 minute ride on that bike we didn't vlog or do anything i was going to get steven to like hold the camera and stuff whilst i was riding so you could see some of the scenery but i thought no the first time i'm riding oh where do we go up or down do you think we have two choices down or up i think up yeah so i thought just on the um on the way up we'll just concentrate on the riding it was epic loved it so much Oh, there's a minging bug. Yeah, so we're at Hospital Cave, which is, I read briefly about it before we came. It's, um, oh my goodness, look at these steps. They're even worse than the wall. <laughs> it was a hospital um, built into caves that they used during the Vietnam War. So we're going to have a little explore of this once we've got mm. all of these steps. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's nice, isn't it? It's the view. This is the view from the entrance of the cave. This is the cave. Okay, I need four missions for Hobbit to to the room. Oh. When American balloon bombing in Katba Island, Vietnamese soldiers went back to hospital gate and live inside here. Inside have a three floor and seventeen room. Have a cinema, kitchen room, doctor room, meeting room, bedroom. Whoa. Right. This is inside the cave. Whoa. <laughs> Oh, this, look at this view. <laughs> Stop it. It's so echoey. Stephen's just going back. Making noises. Ooh. Sweet. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm the first floor. There's just loads of dreams on either side. And some stairs now, I've got this three floor, I don't know whether I'm recording, but it's all these three floors. To this. Come on, let's go up the stairs. So this bit is obviously all mountain made, but the third floor is all natural. I don't know why these people are making this noise. It scares me though. This is it from the outside, the cave that it's in. I think that's kind of it. I think. I don't know where we are. So we're, we're on the other side. No, we, I, I don't know. He said. He said you come out the other side, and we've come out the other side. We were in there for like five minutes. Maybe, yes, maybe we should have got a tour. He asked us if he wanted a tour, and then um, we said no. Because you, I, I mean, I don't know why we said no, but it's no fixed price. You just pay what you want. I hate things like that. 
yeah, that's it. It's well hidden though, look. You'd never be able to find it. Would ya? <laughs> So literally I can't believe that that's it. It was like a five minute thing. It costs 40 dong each to get in, so it's like one pound 20, I suppose, so it's not. 40,000. Not exactly. Did I say 40,000? No, you said 40. Oh, 40,000 dong. It's got one pound 20 odd. So it's not an expensive thing to do, and it was a nice drive up here. I think we're gonna, we're planning on, go, we were gonna go to Cannon Fort, but the hill up to Cannon Fort was quite steep, and I didn't fancy doing that as my first thing to do on the bike. So we, whoa, butterfly. Um, yeah, so I thought we'd leave that until I had a little bit more of a go on the bike. Oh my goodness, there's so many butterflies. Whoa. All these yellow ones, look. There is a lot of butterflies in Vietnam, isn't there? Epic views just outside Hospital Cave. Check that out. It's Cat Bar National Park, I think. This, this bit here is the hospital. You wouldn't know there's a hospital inside that, would you? Mad. Come on, get on. We've, we've kind of biked up that way and so like through the national park and it kind of just leads to the port. We're not gonna go all the way up to the port. So we're heading back, back down now. I'm gonna go maybe loop back round and then if I feel confident enough that I can get up the hill, then we're gonna go to Cannon Fort. Are you ready? It's so nice though, the scenery. Isn't the scenery really nice? Yeah. Is it not? Yeah. <laughs> I think my mum, if you're watching this, would potentially go mad that I'm doing this and got on a bike with Stephen. <laughs> Sorry. I'm drive I am going slow though. I'm not going mad, am I? No. I'm going very slowly. I'm being careful. Although it's not necessarily my driving, is it? It's the other people on the road. But there's, to be honest, like there's no one here. Look. Shh. No sound whatsoever. I wouldn't. There's no way I'd ride one like in the middle of a city or whatever. Or I think this is like a good place to start driving one and like getting used to it and stuff. There's no one around. It's pretty hard to kind of show you the views and that while we're biking along, but they are pretty epic. Isn't they? It is so unbelievably pretty. Just found these steps as we we're going along. Camlen, I don't know what it says. No, I'm not jumping that. No duty, mil oh, military area. No help. duties, keep out. I'm gonna go and have a little look. There's a bike down there, so that wasn't ours, so somebody must be here. Okay, I'm not gonna go any further. There's loads more steps and there's Signs say in danger, so I'm going to go back down. See, we're just sitting down there. Look, see him there. Look at that, though. How pretty is this place? It's so silent. Listen to that. There is nothing but me and the birds cheeping. No, there were some signs that said danger, so I decided not to go any further. Back on the bike. Look at all these cute little goats. Oh, oh man. Oh. oh, there's some more there. Oh, look at him. Look at the goats. The goats. in front of me, I might run you over. Not the best driver. Oh. These little dudes, they little hog things. We're now at Cannon Fort, but let me tell you, we only just made it here. <laughs> we 
We had a fair few disasters on the bike on the way up. I couldn't do that hill. Some woman had to stop. Well, I did do it. Wow, the view, look at that. I'll show you the view in a second. Um, in fact, I'll show you the view now. Look at that. Pretty epic. Right, we're wandering up now. We've left our bike over there. Yeah, the hill. It's a st quite a steep hill up to Cannon Fort and I knew I wouldn't be able to make it. I tried, didn't make it. Woman had to, I, I sort of just, I don't even know what happened, but anyway, we ended up, some woman had to like push us up the hill. And then the entrance, like the way you get your tickets is like halfway up. And I didn't realize it was the ticket place and like she was slowing me down. So it all sort of confused me. So I ended up almost like crashing into the gate. And like I was trying to break, but then I was revving forward and it was a bit of a disaster. We're not hurt though, so that's all right. Slightly concerned about how to get down, but it'll be all right. Whoa, should have put the drone. The drone up here would have been epic. Cannon Fort, so the Cannon Fort was built in 1942. Ooh. Strategic, I'm reading this. A strategic location considered a gateway of the East Sea and also an evidence of the fierce wars against French and America. Whoa. Oh look, here's a little Just cannon number two. Cannon, cannon number two. Oh, we we'll go sure. down here. Oh look, here's the fort. Is not the fort, the cannon. The anti warship cannon. Hey. On what? On standby bunker. Ooh, they've got beer in there. Whoa, look at this. When you come out, I assume this bit here is the military airport, this bit of concrete. We are back from our bike ride, that was awesome, I loved it, although I was a bit shocking at times. Um, yeah, anyway, let's not talk about it. The more I do it, the better I will get is what I'm going to go with. Um, we've just been in the room for a little bit, I've been just doing a bit of work. We're going down, I'm going to, I think we've decided that we're going to stay in Hue, I think it's called H-U-E, I think it's pronounced Hue. Um, so we need to kind of figure out, because we check out here tomorrow, so I need to figure out how we get them. I'm going to go and speak to the manager of the hotel you used to be. Yeah. Um, speak to the manager and see if he can organise it for us or what the deal is. So I've just had a little chat with the manager, he's so nice, the hotel manager, he really is. And to go, to get from here to Quay is we have to go to Lin Linbin or something first. Hang on, I just need to access my... Do you know what, I keep accessing different Wi-Fi if you walk past the bars that we've been in. Um, turn on my personal hotspot for Stephen so he can post them on. Uh, yeah, so we have to go to Linbin first, it's like bus, boat. Overnight bus, I think we're going to do for 690,000. Stephen's just worked out is 24 pounds like that, or 24 pounds each. So I've booked out that's what we're doing. All organised, I don't really know the times and whatever. I think it's maybe a 10 o'clock leave tomorrow. I'll have to do, when we get back, I'll double check and I'll get the details off him. But I think Stephen's not that hungry, but I am starving. I've only had fruit salad this morning for breakfast, that's all I've had. You've only had a pancake. We didn't have any lunch today because we were out and about on the bike. We fancy something to eat somewhere. beautiful watching the sunset. Sunsets are not Stephen's thing as you can see. He's just 
not in any way interested. He wasn't interested in Hong Kong. We went to see that one. Do you remember that video? Remember that, Stephen? Yep. Hong Kong. He was just like, oh, can we go yet? It's the sunset. And he's not interested in this one. This is our last night in um, Cat Bar, so I'm sitting and watching the sunset before we go and have something to eat. So pretty. You can just never have enough sunsets in your life. So, so pretty. Sun rises as well. I've not seen a sun rise, I don't think, since we've been away. I don't know what I prefer actually, sunrises or sunsets. Hmm. Sunrises, I think. I don't see very many of them. So beautiful. This is our choice for tea tonight, the Noble House, Good Bar, I'm not sure what's what, whether it's called the Noble House or Good Bar or it's the what it's called, but this is where we're going. Tea's here, Stephen's gone for his bacon sandwich, I've gone for tofu in tomato sauce with rice, looks nice. My tofu. I don't know if I've said before, I don't think I've ever had tofu before we came on this trip. And it's really quite nice. I only like it when it's been fried, not when it's when we've had it in like when it's been I don't even know what it's been done, like boiled or something. It's like slimy and horrible. When it's fried, it's quite nice. But I'm quite stuck. We're gonna head back. I think we're just gonna have a beer in the lobby. I'm not. I'm gonna have a beer in the lobby. And I'm gonna try and get some editing and get some work done because if tomorrow we're having kind of a travelling day. Obviously not going to have an internet, I think. But overnight busing tomorrow, I need to double check with the manager of the hotel kind of what we're actually doing and what the plan is. But anyway, yeah, be here back in the lobby of the hotel. <laughs> we are back in our room. I've just been editing this vlog, I've realised this is a very long vlog. I don't know whether I will try and edit it down or whether this, that will be it. It will be a long, it will be a long one. Organised, sorted, I've just spoken to the hotel manager and we leave here at one o'clock tomorrow so i'm gonna i may no i'm gonna pack tonight i'm not gonna pack tonight realistically what i'm gonna do is just get into bed oh no we're gonna watch a film we're gonna watch a film tonight so i'm gonna get into bed and watch i don't know what i'm gonna watch but anyway i hope you've had a wonderful batman we're gonna watch batman apparently yeah, wonderful batman. <laughs> i hope you had a wonderful batman i hope you had a wonderful day whatever you have done we have had an amazing day haven't we did you have fun today on the bike Oh, I'm falling off it. Uh, mm, shh, don't talk about the fact that we fell off. We didn't fall off, we just... I did. Yeah, oh, anyway, right. Hope you had a wonderful day, whatever you've done. I will see you guys tomorrow night. Say goodnight. Good night. Close it, close it. Close it.